Hey guys, Mystic Magic Sims here, and welcome to part 9 of Let's Play The Sims 3 Generations. In the last part, Belle Bennington grew up, and we got Marisol pregnant once again. Look at that, she, she just looks so happy. And I was actually thinking about changing up her facial structure, just because, um... The one thing is I got her face and stuff from a pre-made sim in the sim bin, and it sucks. I thought it was pretty, but it's not. It really is not pretty. So, I was wondering if I'd be able to do that. I'm asking you <laughs> I'm asking for permission, basically. So, yeah, guys, do you guys think I should, or do you think I should just, you know, keep her, like this I, I mean she is pretty cute and all but yeah he just looks so no he looks like he's in a bad mood just like why do i have to go to work <gasps> but it is five days until winter and he wants to have a baby girl so we and also kara went to boarding school and she's signing up for an after school class so I think we, I can't wait until we get our inheritance. Oh my god, I cannot wait. Seriously, we need money. We are so running so low with money right now. So, 23,000 simoleons. We need to teach Belle to walk and to potty train her so that we can do that. Yeah. And you are reading with Belle. You're reading with Belle. Belle! Oh, how adorable. That's adorable. Um, clean the dishes. Oh, okay. Cool. So, Alyssa Bennington has learned the play plie move and can now show it off to others. Attend recital at Starry Community School. It's time for Alyssa to show off her... Gr to show off their graceful moves in the ballet recital. She has practiced hard and it's time it's a great time for the family to enjoy the hard work. Just head on over to Starry Community School at the appropriate time. Okay. So when is it? Um Can we do it now? <laughs> oh yes, we can. So they can make it okay so they're all going to try and attend of course without oh. bell but yeah so she's heading over to the ballet recital just because i will forget if i don't do it now so um and it is a dreary rainy day anything new no nothing new <laughs> Oh, I didn't realize this. This looks cool. It's like a dam sort of thing. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, call babysitter. Cannot be left home alone. Of course she can. Come on. This looks like a fancy school. Dang. Whoa. This looks like a fancy school. I mean, seriously. Look, look at this engraving. Oh. Um, I wish my school looked like this. My school does not look like this. <laughs> oh, that's completely true. And I have water and I'm super thirsty right now. So excuse my drinking water. Okay. <laughs> Just drank water. I'm good. Um, so they're all at the recital. So let's speed it up. <laughs> There's gonna be a thunder strike right here, or a lightning strike, just appearing right here. Cool. So, it was a wonderful recital. Alyssa got a great trophy to sh display proudly that she will remind her of how great she danced. Alyssa had, re had a recital at the entire household. Blah, 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 blah. So, look at her. Look at her in her little ballet uniform. Her hair fits so well with it so they're all heading home you are weird you're weird that's weird 
Okay. So, she got a trophy. So that's cool. Um, it's in her inventory, but we are not going to display it just because I need a to wait until we get um some money to go and so I can go and uh, build I'm thinking about building a new house. So, yeah, teach her to talk. Don't worry about teaching her to talk. Just teach her how to walk. I'm actually going to go look for the up uh, for the new house. It's right here. I'm thinking about changing the house. Um like changing it in general because it doesn't look very good. Honestly, it doesn't. It is not what I can do best. Although I do like it. So maybe I will change it up a bit before we move and stuff like that. So, yeah. Now I have the doctor's theme in my head because I was just watching Doctor Who. Um, he is a nurse. He's Rory. Oh, okay. That was weird. That was pretty weird. Um, we're just gonna get rid of that and move, put that there. Move close to the dryer, and you need to have a quick meal. Go ahead and use the bathroom and shower. Then head over here to go and sleep. You will do the same thing after you're done teaching her how to walk. I love her pregnancy outfit. <gasps> Yay! Her first steps. Buy a music box. Of course we'll, we will do that once we get more money. Or once we get a new house. Because I believe the music box does come with generations. So, it's for the sake of this LP. Have a baby girl. You should come home. Come on. Um. You leftover cake slice. Why are you wearing that? Head bobbing. Sorry, that was weird. <laughs> Take a quick shower and then head off to bed. And Belle grows up in seven days. Nine days, eleven days, and three days. Can't wait until we get a new house. Seriously, I am so annoyed with this one. Too small. Way too small. I obsess over houses. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. And one of the... What? It's an imaginary friend. You're not supposed to know where it is. What? I am so confused. That's confusing. And Belle Bennington just learned how to walk. The world just became a little bit bigger for this little toddler. That's adorable. You need to shower and then you need some leftover cake slice. And you want to see Belle age up well. What career are you in? Three. I'm not gonna worry about five right now. And you're playing with Snuggles, isn't that what yours is called? Boinky, not Snuggles. Snuggles. Bleh. I should go put this in the laundry place thing. Yep. Cool. <laughs> Um, not much to do, so I'm just going to cut until tomorrow, guys, so I'll be right back. Okay, guys, and Zachary, Zachary? Zachary is awake, and she he just took care of Belle, and he's going to teach her how to talk. So, yep, there's that. Everyone seems to be in a pretty bad mood right now. Oh, God. She is exhausted. Oh. <laughs> it is almost Alyssa's birthday. It will be Alyssa's birthday in a few days. Why not buy her birthday cake and throw a party? So we will do that later. Though. 
Um, he can't seem to do that. So why don't you just head to bed? Head to work right now. Okay, thank goodness. And I'm actually going to have you teach to talk. And she's feeling germy. <laughs> Crying baby. Oh my goodness. What are you doing? Make bad. Okay. Um, put Belle to bed right now. Why not? And you are supposed to be in school, aren't you? It is, oh no, it's hard to maintain a good relationship when you don't call or hang out with friends. Alfred Bennington and Alyssa Bennington are no longer friends. Oh, that's so sad. Don't ask to leave room. Why? Oh, this is so sad. Okay, why don't you get to school now? And then tomorrow we will... You gotta work on, work on late homework. And tomorrow she is going to... Or after school, she's gonna work with um, Alfred to work on their friendship. So, yeah, that's kind of sad. But, okay, why don't you clean the house? To get the trash, you probably will be doing that. Um, hmm. And you have to call a repair technician. And speaking of that, you have to use the bathroom, and you also have to make a quick meal of cereal. Um, cl clean bug cage. Why is there a bug cage? I don't know, but it is foggy. It is really foggy. Between 2 p.m. and 7 p.m. <laughs> okay, she's still doing the stuff. The repair technician will arrive in about an hour. Um... Since Belle is almost awake, why don't we teach to talk? And he's about, he and uh, Alyssa are about to get out of work. Which is, or work and school. Um, so once he's done with that, he's gonna go ahead and clean out the bad food. Eat some, a cake slice. No, he's going to come home anyway. Use the bathroom and shower. He doesn't need to use the bathroom. Teach her talk. <laughs> Crash a party. Really? Really? <sighs> Do boss's paperwork. Zachary has left work today. That was quite a bit of bug muck, but you took the time to clean the cage and did a great job. The classroom already smells better. Your school performance has improved. Cool. Read Alyssa to sleep. Right, reading her to sleep is a generation's, um, thingy, my bobber. <laughs> interaction and we are actually going to do that tonight so yeah um let's do chat get to know gossip play tag she wants to visit the neighborhood pool and talk to zachary change dirty diaper feed on floor Um, she's doing that stuff, use the bathroom, shower, have a quick meal of cereal. 
Um, he should mop up the puddle. I thought you already did. And clean out the bad food. And... Yeah. Where are you? You're playing tag with your imaginary friend. <laughs> where is... Where is he? Oh my goodness. Where is your imaginary friend? Oh. There he is. Running. <laughs> it looks so funny and hilarious and just creepy at the same time. Uh, he isn't actually a bad mood, so... Why don't you put Belle in the crib? And... You need to stop playing tag. So that you guys can offer to read a bedtime story. So, let's get rid of teaching Kara to drive, because she's not here anymore. And, yeah. Cool, she's... Oh, okay. Oh, that's kind of sad. That we didn't get to do that. Oh, I guess we did. Oh, guess not. Um, offer to read a bedtime story. Come on. We are going to read Ballard's Ballads. In there. What was that? What's going on? Was that just playing the bedtime story? I don't know. I'm kind of scared. What was that? Why don't you head to sleep? Okay, okay. So I will pick up in the morning. I'm kind of freaked out now. Okay, guys. And at 12 o'clock at night, she is finally awake. <laughs> Well, not finally, but I don't know. I don't. I don't know what I was trying to say. Cravings. Okay, that's that's cool. I don't know what that is. Uh, throw a birthday party for Alyssa. Become best friends with Alyssa. Oh my God! Seriously, call the repair technician. And she is really pregnant. And Belle should be getting pretty soon. They're already doing that. They're already doing that. Um, so why don't we just go ahead and change her diaper, feet on floor. And then teach to talk. M puddle. Eat cobbler with melon. And make the bed. Oh. Teaching to talk. <laughs> Even though this isn't seasons, hooray, today is spooky day, which is cool, I guess. We're not going to have a feast party. We're going to throw a feast party, um, probably next time. And everyone is off of school and work, so that's pretty cool. I guess they could sleep in if they wanted to, but I guess they're not going to. Oh my god, oh my god, okay. So I guess we're just gonna have the baby here. I don't really want to have it at the hospital, so we're gonna have the baby here. But the baby is coming. Make sure Marisol is at home, and she is at home. So cool. Well, I guess we're just gonna wait. Don't have the baby at the hospital, don't. Just go here in the living room. Go to the living room, even though we're not even going to be living here very long. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Jeez, this is taking forever. But okay, congratulations on a new baby girl. Oh my gosh, this is like ugh, the fifth girl. Pregnancy had its ups and downs, but Marisol managed to make the best of it. The baby was born with the good and artistic traits. What would you like to name her? I am actually going to not cut, but I'm going to... Go ahead 
into my messages because my friend gave me girl names a while ago. So I'm just going to check them all. Go back up. Go up. It's fall and I can't name her Autumn. Oh, it's out of stock. Did you guys order your casting yet? I don't know, man. I'm not a doctor. Oh, well. May no, make her friendly. Gabby. Okay. Let's see. Um. Hmm. Okay. We are going to name the baby Cece. So, Cece was born with good and artistic traits. So, that's pretty cool. Oh, my God. They're twins. <gasps> <laughs> oh my god, it's twins! <laughs> this is gonna take- Oh my gosh, we need a bigger house. But it's twins! Twin girls! Congratulations! Oh my god, why am I freaking out? Congratulations on the new baby girl. Pregnancy has its ups and downs from her, so I managed to make the best of it. The baby was born with the easily impressed and genius traits. What would you like to name her? I would like to name her... The first thing that comes to mind to okay so we are going to name her flora well no no we're not gonna name her flora i'm saving that name we are going to name her let's name her one second okay we're gonna name her Gabriella or Gabby. So yay, we just had tw baby twins. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's twins. Wow, Jerson, we're so lucky enough to have twins. Double trouble. Oh my god. <laughs> this is gonna be a. This is a big family. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh my god. <laughs> A long lost friend heard about the birth of the twins. He sent each of them a unique toy that is said to create mysterious occurrences to those who gain relationship with it as they age. Get the mail to place it in the twins' inventory. Okay. So, guys, I'm going to end this part here. And look at this. We can get the inheritance. Oh, I'm so happy we can get the inheritance. So, I'm going to go get it. Where is it? inheritance is right here let's see how much money we got uh though marisol's long lost relative will be deeply missed their legacy lives on in marisol's inheritance of thirty one thousand four hundred twenty four simoleons use the money wisely okay guys so i am going to end this part here and go move them in to another house and, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this part. We had twins. So, here is Gabriella. And here is Cece. So, our family is pretty big. When Carol gets back, when she's an adult, I'm actually going to move her out so she can start a generation family of her own. I know it's kind of sad, but, I mean, first child and stuff like that. But, you know, well... <laughs> So, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this part. I, once again, I said that like three times. But I will see you guys later. Bye. Okay, guys, and before I leave, I have decided to show you guys the new house. So, here it is. It's not much. It's just something, at the very least. So, this is just the bottom floor. Um, Let me just do this. Nope, not that. This. This room is going to be Alyssa's room. And this is the master bedroom, the bathroom, the kitchen, the dining room, and the laundry room. As you guys can see, I have a cat box, and I'm deciding to get a cat next part. Um, this is going to be Belle's room, and these are this is the twins' room. So, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this part once again. Tell me what you guys think about the new house. And I will see you guys later.